It is 11.20 a.m. on Sunday the 18th of August and it is time for... Today in my boo journal. Today in my boo -jo. So how are you? So how are you? Are you all right? My throat is killing me today. It really hurts. I took a painkiller, whammy one, um, when I started to edit edit last night's video um so it was like i was buzzing quite nicely when i went to bed but it's it took me a long time for everything my body to relax enough so i could go to sleep but my throat hurts so much today i've already had about three cups of tea i'm on my fourth <laughs> i don't ache too bad which is really really awesome cut up another shirt my stuart bought me this shirt hang on get the hair out of the way stuart bought me this shirt The only thing I wish I could control is is how much, you know, when you cut the arms, it, I've got a black vest top on underneath this because it gapes down really low. But I might have a go at seeing if I can put in some kind of, like, um, seam underneath, just to, or a pleat even, just to, what did you, did you just have some of my drink? You <laughs> ass, just to sort of make it a little bit of a smaller hole. But otherwise I'm gonna have to wear like something else underneath it but I don't know so I did my night care last night before I went to bed I did not do weights because I ached all over I still ache in a few places the uh, funnily enough my left heel is really sore um, and my right hip I've also lost 10 quid which I'm a bit upset about um, I took 20 pound out with me and I bought two drinks when I got there, one for me, one for Alex. And um, I'd had Alex's OPW shirt here because I'd washed it. So I said, I'll bring it, I'll bring it with me, I'll bring it with me. And I left it in the car when I got there. And um, we basically played like a bit of security by keeping people back when there was a table set up for somebody to go through and that. And um, I said to him, look, you're gonna need your OPW shirt, go out to the car and get it. And I got the key out and I had the key and the money and my ID and everything all in the same pocket. And um, I think that was when I lost it. And I didn't even, th oh, Iron Man. I didn't even think about it until this morning. I thought, hang on, I only pulled a fiver out of my pocket last night. I should have pulled 15 quid out. I'm a bit pissed off that I've lost that. But can't be helped. I didn't label 17 as April so kindly reminded me yesterday. Thank you, honey. Might as well label today's while I'm at it for later. I have also discovered if you don't want to make yourself a writing board like I did or you're worried about it being a bit knob and I know a few people said oh isn't that going to be embossed and it's not it's not um, but it is big and I think I made it a bit too chunky by putting two lots of cereal boxes together you could probably just get away with doing it once so that I must admit that one doesn't actually get used but I have discovered that if you want something to use and you're not feeling very creative if you have a tombow blending palette this actually works quite well just to help smooth out if you'd like me and you stick shit in your journal um like for example this tag writing over the edge of it is quite annoying or you know even the postcard well what you do is you put your palette on it like that go to your next page and then you can write and there's no no jog no jog at all not even where um that big chunky tag is the only thing it's jogging on is that receipt so you just put it between you and the receipt and again there's no jog that is really thin compared to that writing board i made it's even thinner than this which i'd been using and this is the shh please carla bring it up um this is what was left over from making my cover it's folded in the same place i'll show you in a minute and I literally cut it off the bottom there you can see where it went um, and it's just been folded up and kept in here I don't actually need that anymore so that can go in my scrap drawer this works brilliantly and this is ideal for traveling about it tucks in there doesn't take up a lot of room so if you want to make a writing board or you want a writing board you, you know you're not feeling crafty or whatever or you don't have a laminator and you want it to be laminated a Tombow blending palette works awesomely okay so steps last night i didn't do a great deal 
um, mainly because I spent the day being quite lazy up until last night. I'm so tired. Oh, guys, well, I'm knackered. That's why I woke you up. No, I know you woke me up. I was not impressed that you woke me up. That's why I was hungry. I still hmm. want some more poops. You want poops, do you? So we did 5,468 yeah. steps last yeah. night. Today is going to be a day of sketching because my son informed me last night that there's a good chance he might actually be wrestling in the next show which is going to be a couple of months away but um he needs a logo and all of that and i need to talk to somebody about how the hell you 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 attach all this shit to tights but i can see it, it's going to end up being hand sewn because my sewing machine doesn't like um stretchy material like neoprene lycra and all that lot and um, my sister-in-law had trouble sewing on it the other week, trying to do costumes, and um, she knows how to use the sewing machine. So uh, if she can't do it, then I can't, and I've only ever sewn three, four things in my life, so. But I might go and buy some, just to have a play with and see if I can you know figure out the sweet spot on on my machine right uh, that's still yesterday's pen I didn't do anything last night um, let's get right up to today okay that was all ticked off Kyle turned up at half past six nice and prompt like he is I'll feed you in a minute Daryl please and then I stuck the leaflets that I showed you last night. Strings is the name of the venue where we want. I stuck some tape around the bottom just to make it a little bit stronger. I found this bag in my scrap stuff last night. I don't know what came in it. But um, yeah, I stuck the uh, the bloodied <laughs> things from Jack in here. And um, my son actually messaged him last night and said, we have your blood. The cloning process has begun. <laughs> Which is awesome. So we're going to change the pen. Yeah. We need to change the pen. We need to change the pen, don't we? Yeah. That's why we're going to hide Iron Man. So because... You want to see my Iron Man page? There you go. Iron Man wants to come see it. Iron Man wants to come see it. Come on then, Iron Man. Hurry up. That's going to be fine. Bring him into the camera so everybody can see him. Yay. See how well I did. Come here. Come here. Come here. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. He's not bad at all. He's on. needed to make that maybe a little bit thinner, but eh, no, I'm pleased with his, it all in all. Knee, it needs to be bigger so it can be Iron Man to take the bad guys down. Ah, oh, okay. So okay, can... weather. It is, it's, it's, it's mixed. Today, when I got up, I got a sticky hot dread. When I got up, um, it was raining and my son was told you don't need to come into work just yet so he went back to bed um fully dressed he couldn't be able to get dressed. he just got back in bed um and was told to come in for half 11. that was a uh, nine half nine by quarter past 10 the sun had come out and i was like Shit, he's gonna i don't want to wake him up because he has to go back in you know and he left and it was bright sunshine and now the gray clouds are reappearing so i'm interested to see what the weather is going to say so we'll start with clear day just for the giggles can, I have a look? can you have a look right wait because it's still loading up so it says overcast Do we keep and the, it? Uh, it reckons there might be more rain let's have a look at the hourly one so it reckons it's going to be rain about one o'clock and then the sun's going to come out for the afternoon and then rain more rain tonight awesome so what they're saying is they don't know. <laughs> That's what when I when I see that they've put a mixed bag like that down, I'm always like, so you don't really know what's going to do then. Whoa. Now, um, <coughs> see, the Met Office doesn't agree. The Met Office says we're going to have sunshine all afternoon and a clear night all night. That's really interesting. So which one do I go with? I, I have heard we've got hot weather coming um, 
for the long weekend, which is next weekend. So it'd be interesting to see. Um, I don't know. I don't know. What, I don't know whether to follow the Met Office or that other app. Shh, please. I'm going to follow what the Met Office says. I think. Well, actually, it doesn't really matter, does it? Because I've had rain, so I can put down that rain and sunshine with a cloud. <laughs> I've got a little bit of like a glare headache. Oh, I'm going to have to take some more painkillers because I think it will develop into a migraine. I'm wondering if the glare that I'm getting is a visual, you know, migraine thing when people see light. I don't often um, get visual disturbances with a migraine. That bit of, that, it's, it's, a, it's a little baby dread and it's annoying me. Yeah, I don't often get visual disturbances with migraines, but everything seems rather bright this morning. And I'm wondering if it's due to that. Oi! So I think the safest thing to do would be to take a painkiller and um, hope it doesn't evolve. So, right, now 19 over 15, the Met Office reckons. And 19 over 12. So, so 5.56 and 8.20 for sunrise and sunset. I've also, I'm also having quite a bit of trouble like focusing on stuff. It's like when I first got my glasses, everything seems really difficult. I think I'm going to take a painkiller. I'm sorry because it seems to all of a sudden be getting worse. I haven't got time for a headache. I've got to design my son's logo for wrestling. I've never been asked to draw somebody something before because I've only literally been doing drawings since I started bullet journaling which was last February. So to actually have someone say you know you're artistic enough could you draw me this is um, pretty special actually I've, uh, yeah we've already decided on the style of writing he wants which is awesome I hate rain. yeah I hate rain as well baby I really so I need to actually draw the rain on because I haven't done that Yeah, I'm, I'm actually thinking that I'm gonna, what I, when I do the weather, I do what the predicted weather is for today, but I'm actually thinking I might just do it at the end of the day, you know, check the weather app a few times and, f shush please, find out what the temperature is sort of throughout the day, and then put down what the weather actually was, because there's been times when I've put the weather down and it's not been that at all, it's been something completely fucking different, so, yeah, right. I've done my day face cream. I'm having an argument over tidying his room. Something he was told to do yesterday and didn't get done. And something I said to him, I said, right, fine, you do it tomorrow when you get up. He's had his breakfast. He's got nothing else to be doing. So he could be upstairs tidying his room. So he's procrastinating. That was what I meant to write on that day. It wasn't dithering. I was thinking it was procrastination. That's the word I was thinking of with the hanged man the other day. Um, yeah, so he's procrastinating, trying to find excuses for not doing it. His room is a fucking bear tip. He's also got this thing at the moment where he gets his juice cut. I give him this, like these drinks cut. They're like sports cups and they've got a straw that pops up. And they're great for kids because they're supposed to be non-spill. Well, I don't know whether it's because his are old or... Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, you definitely jumped. Um, I don't know whether it's because his are old or what, but he's now developed this thing where he pours it from his juice cup into his plastic tea set. And... Um, it's ended up all over the floor. The, the, the floor is wet with squash and it smells now so I've got his window open I've got all the windows upstairs open but the room smells and I'm so pissed off because I can't get in there to tidy up and clean up because there's toys everywhere 
So I keep telling him, will you please get up there and tidy up? So I can at least go in and flip in vacuum. And he's like, oh, I don't want to. So I'm like, fine, I'll turn my bin bags. So, the nine of blades. Someone is down, someone is depressed. Someone is hiding. From themselves, from life. Someone is maybe struggling a little bit. Um, you're at a turning point or this person is at a turning point they're at their darkest hour at the moment but it is always the darkest just before the dawn okay um, you can see the pills on the nightstand doesn't look like any have been taken maybe the thought was there but none have been taken um, you're not on your own you've got the wee, wee doggy look the wee doggy's there, the wee doggy loves you somebody loves you if this is you if this card is resonating with you please feel free to PM me okay I'm always good for a chat if you know somebody who is in this situation again feel free to PM me um, maybe we can come up with some ideas on how to help this person but seriously if this is you I'm good for a chat all right um, if you don't want to talk to me then I recommend maybe you go and talk to your GP or a family member just spend some time with people because this little doggy here is representing people that do love you okay people that do care about you you are not on your own nobody is on their own you are at the turning point seriously okay please do not struggle on your own you can do it i believe in you um you can pm me by following the social media links scroll down okay there's a social media link or there is um my link tree address is on my YouTube homepage. The banner at the top down in the right hand corner. You can click that. Um, but yeah, if you go to link tree, pretty tapper, that will give you links onto my Facebook, my Instagram, my Twitter. You can PM me on any of those. You'd be best off using Facebook, okay? Because that's the one I get notifications on. Instagram, I get a visual one, but it doesn't make a noise. And if I don't look at my phone, I don't see it. So yeah, Instagram or Twitter, okay? But if this is you, and you're in this dark place and you feel like there is no way out message me all right i don't know who you are um, you know and i i'm not going to tell anybody okay between you and me guys okay right um, okay five thousand four hundred and sixty eight steps 2.27 miles right now let's come forward and hit the whoa jumps out hit the, yeah i was awake for over an hour in the night and that was due to pain basically but it was worth it and i'll do it again <laughs> let's do it again let's do it tonight yeah. oh, poor buggers i suspect they probably need the a bit of time to rest and recuperate okay so now it says 1 30 until 9 20 but no that's not right i just simply refused to get up so the hour and whatever it was i was awake was just me lying in bed i've been awake since about eight o'clock much to daryl's disgust because he wanted me to get up and i was like no don't want to so I slept until about four and then I was awake for a bit and then I slept again until about eight. Um, it was a bit better than the night before. I feel I feel good. I feel, you know, I just could have slept a lot longer. <laughs> I need to find a home for my little feather dye before it ends up broken. Because that would really upset me. Right. We are getting there. This is really starting to chunk out. I can feel it now. It's great. <laughs> um, what is it? It's Sunday. It's Sunday, guys. Oh, it's stripped to bed today. 
I wonder whether it'd get dry. I might go. I might risk it. The dog's just stunned. this like, mm, like, ooh, this is. Just, I'm so tired. I know how she feels. I'm so tired too. Okay, so um, vacuum upstairs. That actually got done. Alex did it the other day. So I'm not going to do it because he did it. I messaged Callie that day. It was Friday. Yeah, he did it Friday. So I'm going to grab Friday's pen quick and just colour that in because it doesn't need doing again. Just Daryl's room, but that can be done when he's tidied it. So yeah, yay. Awesome job. Not that that pen looks any fucking different. Right. Um, I suppose I could text Kyle and tell him we are ready to marvel. We're up and ready. There we go. That's him told. Um, I ordered some ink. I bought three new pens. I bought a... Uh, is it Jin Hao that um, April's been like recommending strongly to me? So I went on Amazon um, yesterday because I had a little bit of money and I thought, oh, do you know what? Fuck it. I'm going to buy, I'm going to buy a pen. I'm going to buy a couple of pens because I wanted a new, um, I wanted some more of these because I love this pen. It is fantastic to write with i love that you can see the ink in it i love everything about it even the size so i went on looking for those primarily and to buy printer ink um they're actually cheaper to buy those little pens on ebay than they are on amazon but there we go and i ordered when the picture finally shows up <clears throat> i ordered that isn't that pretty I think I ordered that colour. Did I order that colour or did I order the red one? Yeah, no, I, I must have ordered that one. I thought I'd ordered the red one. I either ordered the red purple one or the blue green one. I can't, do you know, I honestly cannot remember. I thought I ordered the red purple one. I know that was a little bit more expensive. And it's got blue green on there, so. Oh well, whatever. If they're nice, I might order the red purple one as well. You never know. And then, so I ordered that and some ink, and then I went on eBay, and I, <laughs> I or, yeah, ink as in for my printer because my my uh, printer has run out of ink. And then I went on eBay and I bought a bottle of, it's either diamine or diamine shimmering fountain pen ink called purple pizzazz which I'm like yes which is awesome let's see if I can find the this is apparently the purple pizzazz it's purple with gold in it so I'm like oh! so yeah I've I've bought I bought that and then I bought those two the dark pink and the light pink because I really, really like those. I know there is a purple one floating about, but it's just plain. So, um, you know, I, I, I might order those at some point. But yeah, I've, so I've, I've got three pens come in and only one bottle of ink. <laughs> so I'm not, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do there. So I need to buy more ink. So next week, I've got some money coming in and I might order myself some of that Noodler's Grey ink. But I'm also quite tempted to try that ink thing that April does. She does. She gets this ink subscription um, from. Oh crap! Who's it? Who is it? April. I can't remember. I have to go have quickly look at her channel. Ink Redible, yeah. Ink Redible boxes, and it's a subscription thing that she gets, and it's like we bottles with ink in it. I, I think you only get like a couple of mil of ink. But a couple of mil of ink goes a long way and it's a good way of sort of finding out what colours you like, you know. I'm quite tempted to do it, but it's 20, is it about £25 a subscription and then it's got to be shipped over here. And I'm worried customs will, because I've already subscribed to one thing that's coming from the States. 
and I'm worried that customs will bite my ass. So, yeah, look, guys, we are getting chunky. Look. And that is because of that ta envelope tag. All the receipts I keep shoving in here. Postcards. Photies. <laughs> this is becoming quite a... Uh, there's another postcard. More receipts. Little card from Jo Lynn. And then the bag with... Um, last night's uh, blood soaked bits of paper okay I'm gonna do this stencil again simply because it's new and I'm loving it and I'm playing with it I love that I have these numbers in all different sizes now I really like this one but it is so thin I wish it was a little bit thicker I really do because it lifts if you're not careful Okay, I did not write the word yesterday and I meant to put it there and then I journaled. So I'm going to have to write yesterday's word here. What was yesterday's word? Energy. Yeah, oh, sh I'm so cross now because I thought last night when I went to bed, you could write energy there and that would be perfect. It would break up. I had a bit of a crappy start to yesterday. It would break up that from writing about the awesomeness of last night and I'm really really cross I forgot to do it now so it's like, fuck but there we go right so I'm just gonna stick my little blending tool in there I don't like the G's okay so energy was the word for yesterday the word for today is triumph what a fab set of words considering like yesterday was wrestling and I really enjoyed it. So let's write that down across here. Not too sure about the H, but you know, whatever. It looks good. Quite like how that's come out. Okay, so we are set, ready to go for today. Um, I won't be doing a lot because I do ache and I just, yeah. But I think I am going to go and strip my bed and get that on the line. Well, washed and then on the line. Ooh, I've got a scapey bit here. What? Be a thumbs up. <laughs> right, so I guess I'm going. So there we go. Um, thank you and I will see you in the evening edition tonight. So don't forget... Leave us a comment because we like comments. Click the book and you'll be subscribed. And if you hit the bell, you'll, you'll be notified when we upload new content. Thank you so much for joining us and I will see you in the evening edition. Bye, Bye. guys. some printer ink who did have pen coming from Amazon and then eBay diamine ink mini that pens right we did the weather so I did the challenges been no booze not had chips. I haven't crafted. I used to have that today. I've done the garden. I have done the garden, I haven't done my weights. Mood wise, it's been a normal sort of day, really. I had one moment of err uh, today, which most of you will know if you read Facebook. I've got Daryl sucking up his juice he's got like this cup with a pop-up straw and then just all over my carpet and he's been doing it in his room as well because his bedroom carpet is wet as well and um i thought he'd like knocked his drink over during the night or something and that's why but the, the wet has like continued so it was just like i was like what the hell are you doing absolutely livid Not impressed at all. 
It was like he couldn't understand why I was cross. He was like, what? What? What I've done? What I've done? Can I have my drink back? I was like, no! <laughs> you know? So he just didn't get it. And then when I said to him, you know, you've made me really cross. He was like, well, that makes me really sad. And I was like, so why did you do it? And he's just like, do what? I did strip my bed. I need to go and make my bed. So I did laundry as a result. Dishwasher's been on. We have done Marvel today, so that's this week finished. It's week 33 done, peoples. We are going into week 34, look. <laughs> that was the stamp I got in my haul that I showed you the other week. This came from a little stamp shop, I think it was. The one that came in the wee bag. And um, I put it there because a friend of mine's really into, and I got a text her, a friend of mine's really into um, DSLR cameras and I want to get one because I want to be able to film the wrestling shows a little bit, you know, do another perspective kind of thing. And um, I don't really know a lot about digital cameras. I don't know about white balance and, and all that kind of thing, you know. So um, I've asked her if she wants to sort of teach me. And she's recommended a camera and um, she's cause she, and she's got one so she's gonna let me go over uh, on friday pardon me and um have a go so i've journaled today so i'm all caught up oh i did a little card little journaling card to go in here because i didn't write it down on the actual journal part this is neil's um making his entrance and I was stood on the corner, sort of down here from this, if you like, not this corner here, but this side. And um, he came out and did his entrance, the bats around the ring, and um, took his jacket off and handed it to me. And the minute it touched my hands, I knew he was wearing Stuart's leather jacket. And I hadn't been told this was gonna happen. Um, I said to Emma afterwards, I said I wasn't expecting that, and she said, no, we talked about it, she said I didn't even know he was going to do it today. So yeah, he, he just handed it to her and I held it for the entire match, and yeah, literally the minute my hands touched it, I knew it was Stuart's, and Alex said, you recognise it? I said, yes, I do, and I had a lot of trouble controlling myself, because um, I wondered whether Neil was going to keep it, because um, if he wasn't, I was going to ask for it. But yeah, so um, it's, it's not a brilliant picture, but actually I really, really like it, and... Um, yeah actually it can't, can't it matches <laughs> matches my freddy shirt <laughs> so um yeah i was really, really pleased with that i was a bit fucked off there because i cut and then my corner around had screwed up doing the first corner but that's okay that's fine so that's in there yeah so that's it that's that's all i've got for today people I think I'm going to go make my bed and I'm going to go and get in it because I'm tired. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please feel free to give me a thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to leave us a comment down below. We love comments. If you click the book over here, you'll be subscribed. And if you hit the bell that appears, you'll be notified when I upload new content. Thank you so, so much for joining me today. I really, really do appreciate it each and every day that you join me. And I will see you on Monday's edition of Today in my Bujo. Take it easy, guys.